so I just wanted to give you a, a bit of an insight into some top tips from working from home. So as you can probably see like yourselves, this morning working from my kitchen. Um, so I'm just gonna go throughout the day and just give some real key tips to keep yourself motivated, keep yourself working effectively when working or indeed learning from home. Um, so whether that's you uh, as senior members of your business or those of you that are potentially still in learning and are on furlough and looking for some top tips when working out your bedroom, your lounge, your kitchen, like myself. So my first first top tip of the day is get yourself set up in a nice area. So I've got my laptop ready to go. I've got my sticky whiteboard with some key tasks for me to do today. I think that's a real first key is get yourself a nice area where you can work from and also give yourself some really key tasks for that day that you're going to achieve. Whether that's work related or whether that's something that you want to do personal in regards to your own personal development, your own learning. Um, make sure you do like give yourself that target throughout the day. So I'll drop in every now and again throughout the day and give you some more advice for when working from home. Second top tip for you for when working from home is make sure you have plenty of contact with others. So you can see here we've got our, our lovely TWPT TV and uh, TVS team on our call this morning. We do this every morning at 8.45 and just set out what we're all doing for the day. And actually it's really nice just to have this kind of quarter of an hour just to touch base. Um, so likewise, like I said, everybody's found a really nice space. You can see um, various people working in different areas within their house, but they found a nice quiet place to jump on the call. So guys, just want you to say hello to all of our learners and listeners and viewers. Um, and yeah, keep contact with people, whether it's your work colleagues or your friends. It's really nice during this lockdown just to have 10 minutes to chat to someone, refresh your mind and then get back to your daily tasks. When you're sat there and you're reading your computer screen, you can't see anything, you just it's all going blurry, you're not getting anything done. Make sure you take yourself five minutes to go and relax, get your head back on it, and then come back to your work. To move location. If you've got the luxury of being able to move from your kitchen to your lounge, wherever it might be, to freshen up your environment a little bit, then to do so. It's really good to get your head back onto the task. So you can see I've actually moved to my spare room, um, which I usually use as a dressing room, but actually makes quite a good office for when I'm working at home. It's going to help me to get re-energised, refocused on my task and keep working throughout my day. So keep going, guys. Make sure you freshen yourself up throughout the day. Measuring how much I'm doing. It's really nice on a daily basis to know that I've gone from A to B each day. It gives you that real sense of pride, real sense of achievement. So make sure you're measuring what you're doing. Guys, I really hope uh, this has helped uh, and it's given you some ideas how to work, work from home. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, keep an eye out on the YouTube channel for more content and obviously more live shows coming to you soon. <laughs>